A dish like this, served at Dee's Diner in Plains Township, is the same plate handed out for free to people being served by Fork Over Love, a nonprofit Tracy Salingo started to help those in Luzerne County that are struggling to put food on the table. We have one of the highest food insecurity rates in the state. Um, if we look at the numbers, it's over 40,000 people in Luzerne County. A need that's growing just as fast as food prices are increasing. Our numbers, our lines, the people who come out every week um, to receive a free community dinner, those lines are just continuing to grow. The inflation in the grocery store is not only impacting customers, but restaurant owners like Dave Crappa. He owns the Avenue in Wyoming and says Fork Over Love's newest initiative, Restaurant Week, is already boosting his business. We had phone calls for takeout orders. I mean, we just opened it up yesterday, that menu, and it, it just blew up. Restaurant Week invites customers to dine out at 50 different restaurants across Luzerne County. Their specials do more than raise funds for Fork Over Love. It brings new business into the booth, supporting owners like Dave. Even though that meal going out might bring 10 more meals back in for us. And his staff at the Avenue, who volunteer their own time to pack meals for those who rely on Fork Over Love. Did the extra income to be brought in for our employees to keep them going as well. They have mouths to feed just like I do as well. While Restaurant Week goes until this Saturday, Dave wants to continue being involved with Fork Over Love, adding they've helped him build back his restaurant while giving back to his neighborhood. With the volume starting to come back, it does make things a little bit better. We're able to buy a little bit better because we do have some extra revenue coming in. To find the full list of participating restaurants, look on our website, WNAP.com. Claire Alford, Newswatch 16, Luzerne County.